Star Wars Rogue One, trailer number three. You've seen the trailer, I know what you're expecting. You're expecting me to stand here and gush about how awesome Rogue One looks. Well, I got some news for you. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it, no. Okay, I lied. Let's let's talk about it. I just want December 16th to get here or whatever day the movie comes out. I'm ready. I'm ready. Where are you at, December 16th? I got my money. I got my Rogue One toys. I've been practicing my Forrest Whitaker. Oh, well, you do. Nakachu. So obviously, because I have eyes, I can tell you that uh, Rogue One looks awesome. This is easily the best trailer they've done for this movie. Not only is this movie going to look visually fantastic, but aesthetically, it's probably going to be the best looking Star Wars movie we've had yet, even though I've only seen the trailers. But judging from the trailers, this movie is going to be beautiful. And they're also showing that it's going to have layers to it. There's going to be emotion. It's not just a collection of cool looking shots and set pieces. They gave us a little bit of story with this trailer. And it looks like we get some more of that trademark Star Wars daddy issues. Because nobody does daddy issues better than Star Wars. Uh, this lady right here. Jen Urso, she's the one for the Rebels to steal the plans to the Death Star. And, uh, oh, what's that? What's that you say? Your dad's one of the key people designing the Death Star? That's kind of awkward. That's that's probably going to cause some friction. I've seen some people on the internet complaining, saying, well, why would this guy design a weapon of mass destruction? Well, uh, you know, the dude's got to eat. There's probably not a ton of jobs out there. Probably went to school for a long time for engineering. He's got a ton of student loan debt. He's fallen behind on his payments to Nelnet. And uh, the Galactic Empire, they, uh, they just happened to be the first place to hire him. So, you know, a job's a job. And uh, why, don't you, why don't you just lay off the guy? Cut him some slack. So, yeah, dude's got to earn some money somehow. And uh, designing a Death Star, I'm sure that's a decent paying gig. He's probably pulling in like six figures. And he'll redeem himself by leaving that open vent in it. So Luke can make his famous trench run from A New Hope and blow that baby up. Also, did you see Darth Vader? He took like half a step out of the smoke or the fog or an 80s music video and he looked like a total badass. He just has such an iconic walk, that, that crazy Darth Vader walk. It was like a power walk, like a very angry power walk, like he had just received a very upsetting hologram message and it pissed him off and then he was going to kill some rebel scum. Cause because that's what you do when you're Darth Vader. You kill rebel scum. Seriously, Disney, don't chicken out. Don't get soft on us. Lots of rebels need to die in this movie. Lots of rebels need to die in order to add weight to the situation, to make it seem very serious, to make the Empire seem very deadly. Uh, needs to feel as hopeless as possible as we head into A New Hope. So there needs to be like zero hope, and then we go into A New Hope, and then there's a, there's a little bit of hope. There's a new hope. Because obviously the Rebels, they end up getting the plans to the Death Star. And uh, I think Forrest Whitaker's ragtag group of Rebels, they need to die in order to really show why the plans were so important to the Empire. Because, you know, they spent a couple of bucks on that Death Star. They can't have it getting all blown up. But anyway, I could keep going on and on about Rogue One. I know they did some reshoots recently. There's rumors going around about why they did the reshoots. I'm not going to worry about that. I just want the movie to be awesome. That's all I want for Christmas. Just make Rogue One awesome. That's all I'm asking for. Thanks for watching. I'm Jared Cook. What did you think of this latest Rogue One trailer? Tell me down below in the comments. Thumbs up the video. Subscribe to my channel for more videos. And see you